Hey, what's going on, y'all? It's your boy Troy here on the ASS Family Channel. I'm here with the one and only. Come on, man. Y'all know it. Mom. Ha! <laughs> we got Dorbo. Shout out Dorbo. I ain't gonna lie. Mm -hmm. We watch this, uh, we watch his videos. The levels of money. That was a great video. I ain't gonna yep. lie, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, yo, Dorbo really doing his thing. Now we got the seven levels of insecurity. I just told mom, love talking about this topic, cause huh, I don't got no insecurities, bro. I don't care. <laughs> yo, we ugly, we broke, <laughs> we doing all this. <laughs> Let's get our cheese all up. Alright, well, come on. A lot <laughs> of people got some. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, no, no, in all seriousness though, if you got insecurities, bro, don't worry about it. Especially if it's not something you can change. Like, 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 I guess what? Your face? Yeah, you, 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 bro. You can change it. You got money. Oh, yeah, nah, but we ain't so. doing no plastic surgery and Botox, bro. Come on, bro. We, oh, you can put makeup on. You can beat your face. Nah, nah, nah. We we ain't Barbie or Ken's, bro. All right, well. We cooling. <laughs> I'm, but you can I'm change cool. it, though. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to just get my money on up, not my fun on up. Y'all know how I'm going to do. But yeah, bro, shout out Dorbo. Like I said, please go subscribe to Dorbo. Um, yes, if, of course, if do. you don't watch the original video, Dorbo will be in the description below to give your own opinions and conjecture. If you don't want to hear us, yap. Huh. And go and go support Dorbo, like I said. Mm -hmm. But yeah, let's see. Seven levels of insecurity. Let's see how we humble is living. I laid in a Walmart entrance. I'm short, bald, and have acne. So now that you know I beat all the <laughs> bosses of insecurity, let's organize this from most insecure <laughs> to least. Okay. Starting off with level one, we have psycho delusional insecurity. At this level, oh, these people was that the Uvalde bull? Who is it? Texas governor, 14 children, one teacher. Yeah, this is the Uvalde bull. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah, this is, this is not, in, this, I, you know, I don't even want, like, I want to speak on this subject because I remember this when go. this first happened, Ooh. yo, we was crashing out bad. So I was I in the joint, like, bro. Concentrate. I'm so, I'm not going to lie. Yo, we might get our channel down. I take this jump, but I'm so mm -hmm. happy, bull himself bro because i ain't gonna lie in jail they was going they was really going oh, torture he, bro yeah, he was like hurt. like they was really going like bro he was gonna get the worst of it on he deserved it yo he's having dinner with satan right now mm -hmm. <laughs> trust me like he's having he's straight having dinner with lucifer i'm gonna keep it right, well, let's not even give him that this attention. ain't even insecure actually it is insecurity because <laughs> you went out the children bro Hey, he literally, I think he literally said himself or somebody found out whatever he would he didn't do this at his own high school because they no, was gonna beat him up mm -hmm. <laughs> disgusting anyway yeah this 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 we have psycho delusional insecurity at this level these people need to get serious help since they, they see do. the whacked out perception of reality as the whole truth this is the group that'll say something like girls will only date guys who are six three millionaires which if they ever went outside they'd notice pretty quickly that's not the truth that's i know jokes saw some that's dude so who stupid. looked like this actually not nah, a red pill bulls be saying this too bro y'all sound retarded <laughs> y'all sound stupid bro stop like, and that's coming from the bull. I really like cheese, bro. I really think everybody should get their money up, bro. Mm -hmm. Bro, <clears throat> just having cheat, bro. You can you can get a girlfriend slash boyfriend. This could apply to anybody, whatever, right? Or whatever, whatever partner. Without cheese, bro. Or at least without a lot of cheese, mm -hmm. bro. Like, come on, man. They, like, it's dumb. I don't know why we're still seeing this. With his girlfriend the other day. Hey girl, let me get your number. <laughs> Not the oh, truck man. You can call me any time. A Chad's, I swear. These are the people who think themselves into their insecure delusions so bad that they end up lashing out and possibly doing something absolutely insane. The reality is they really aren't thinking though. The truth is that they often are just hearing content online and they consume it all day and since the brain is a confirmation machine, they'll look for something to prove their deluded truth to be true. Uh, and then they'll TikTok. follow up with ignoring reality. See, bro, this is proof all girls are horrible. But I will cheat because I'm bored. Wait, so... Wait, Wow, you... <laughs> that just got deep. Bro, you're looking okay. at the bottom of the barrel and saying every girl is like exactly. that. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Like, yo, y'all got... Her... <laughs> bro, heads will be watching Fresh and Fit, bro, to whatever podcast, bro, and be like, dang, bro, yo, girls is really trash. They tripping. You watching the bottom tier? Oh my mm -hmm. god, bro! You watching the actual bottom tier of life? Like, yeah, you gotta realize, like these red pill bulls and these, like, and these, like, um, a manosphere girls or whatever, bro. Mm -hmm. They're literally living the life that ninety percent of people are not. Like, like we not treating, <laughs> right? We not doing OF. We not doing none of this, doing, bro. Most people is just chilling, going to work, trying to provide for their fam, bro. <laughs> Like, yo, y'all young boys is crazy. I knew I was gonna like this video. <clears throat> Fishing in the sewer. They might even make up scenarios in their head to validate their absolutely insane thoughts, but this isn't exclusive to these people, which leads us to level two, projector gadget. Oh, I see great. this once in a while, oh, and it's man. quite honestly a little scary, since these people are very delusional. They'll often see things as an attack at them when really it isn't, but there's a slight truth to some things. For example, one I've personally noticed is that usually people call someone short with a negative connotation and vice versa. Excuse me, sir. 
I must say you're a manlet and you should be ashamed for being born. Oh, I mean, it's so oh, bad that oh. people say things such as Napoleon complex, when in reality it's not really warranted. I've seen as bad as hearing people say you're compensating since you're doing well for yourself, but it's not compensating if you have desirable physical traits. So I can see how people can perceive things that aren't truthfully there. When a lot of times it's all these minor social nuances, my trick is to personally take everything as a compliment since, for one, it upsets the person trying to insult you, since they get their validation from mm -hmm. putting others down, and two, it's best for your mental not to read into the negative side of anything, even if it yeah. is there. Yeah, and, that, and, and that is literally facts like bro if you gotta if you gotta put somebody else down so you can mm -hmm. feel good you are quite literally the definition of insecure bro like and i'm not gonna cap bro let's really lock in <laughs> like bro why are mm -hmm. you so focused on somebody else bro worry about yourself i always say bullies bully because they get bullied exactly bullies bully because they get bullied like, they know the reason because they want to get that attention off of them so they gotta Put it on to somebody else, all that negativity. Especially if it's something that you can improve, like you literally can improve on it yourself, right? Mm -hmm. Why are you worried about what I'm doing, how I look, my features, my life, or mm -hmm. whatever, when you insecure about your own and you have the time, the time that you would put in, the time mm -hmm. that you are putting in to put me down, to put, put me up. down, mm -hmm. could be used to improve yourself. <laughs> Yo, these boos be so backwards, and then they be wondering why. Like, I never understand this type, June. Like, I really don't. For women to say, oh, you're five feet on dating sites? You should be dead? That's okay? Who said that to you here? Nobody. The women in general have said it on dating sites. He's angry. You think I'm making that shit up? Go ahead and attack me. Okay, fuck. Oh. Oh. Man, just shut up. Yeah, bro, he built like a dwarf too, and I'm not even trying to be me. Or I guess you, I guess that could go on the John. I'm insecure because I'm short. Yeah, I'm short too, bro. I'm not gonna. I'm like five ten. I'm short. I'm Johnny. like, bro, compared to the six foot bull, I'm short, and him compared to me is short. That's tough. Like I ain't gonna lie, bro. We all short to somebody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the bull that's six foot three, they talk about Chad is short to Victor Winbanyama. He's seven five. Mm -hmm. Like, bro, how many tall bulls you know that's that tall? Mm -hmm. Like, bro, what? It's a waste of time, bro. Y'all better just keep trying to improve yourselves and not become a jerk doing it, bro. You just, yeah. bro. He angry. Like, he's mad, bro. He said, he said, you won't put your hands on him. He sure, he sure did. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. You think I'm making that shit up? Go ahead and attack me. Yeah. Oh my God. You said it. Oh my God. You said it, my if bad. If say something <laughs> true but a bit controversial, you'd see oh. people getting heated about it. But the reality is they aren't getting mad at me. They're getting mad that it applies to them since a secure right. person doesn't mm -hmm. get angry about a statement, let alone one that's on a pre-recorded video. The secret is to be secure of your own validation so what others say matter very little. But you should still be open-minded, of course. <laughs> your eyes are so far apart, you look like Sid from Ice Age. Yep, appreciate okay. it. That that is the nut, bro. I'ma do it to y'all, and I don't even care again because y'all, I'm secure, bro. If somebody be like, I'm ugly, I'ma probably be like, yo, you right, bro. Whenever I take off my glasses, gang, y'all can see it right now. This is the number one. This is the number one John I get every time. Yo, bro, your eyes far apart, gang. You look like Sid from Ice Age. I'm like, dang, bro. Fifteen already said this. We gotta come up with a new one. <laughs> I'm like, dang, bro. Like, it's funny. I'm gonna give it a buck. And it's true. Ha, ha, ha. Keep it even more of a stack, bro. Dang. Like, I'm not even laughing at it no more. Not because, like, y'all, oh, dang. Like, it's not funny. Oh, why would you say that? Because I'm like, dang, bro. I, I like the creative you need to see. Put your glasses back on. That's what I'm saying. That, that too. I'm like, yo. Trust me. Most of the time, my glasses is not gonna be off, bro. I'm blind. <laughs> <laughs> That's tough. Like, bro. I'm dead. Uh Oh, uh, oh yeah. What? Well, well, your shoes are ugly too. <laughs> okay, man. Mm -hmm. Stop one. playing my man Crocs. Mm -hmm. And here we are mm -hmm. with level three. Not comfortable in your own skin. I feel like we've all been here, especially in our younger years, when you start to get acne, and it's mm -hmm. not easy to go about being slightly self-conscious. And something you learn with time is that you either accept it or try your hardest to fix it, which can be a negative or a positive thing, depending on the route. You, you know what's funny? I'm doing both right now, technically. I'm gonna be real. Because it's like, yo, you know what I, I accept it like, yo, obviously, if y'all know I ran track or whatever, running track, I was pretty fit. And I'm going to lie. I'm running every day. I'm like, yo, mom, we got to get the tready in the basement, bro. I'm trying to get back to that gym. So I can accept the fact that like, yo, there, like maybe I, I'm not in a spot, at least physically, that I mm -hmm. want to be in. 
But instead of like, dang, man, I, I got, I'm, I got, I'm just ugly now. Or I be saying that as memes or whatever, bro. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Y'all know if a bull is ugly for real, for real, bro. And, and again, ugly is also subjective in itself. So we could really get into the combo for real, for real. But like, yo, I'm like, I bet I'm finna put the tready in the basement, start running on the tread. Instead of just complaining every day, man, I'm ugly. I'll never make it. I'll never do this, that, and the third. It's memes, bro. Mm -hmm. Doing something about it. Doing something about it. Like, bro, we not we not sitting here just complaining. Like, come on, man. For but real, wait, bro. before you start that, I, I just yeah. thought about it. Um, they was talking about the acne, the acne, whatever acne. it's called. You yeah, gonna you know, get you acne, from, bro. You know I can't grab them, but anyway. Oh. So keep on. Yeah, not people, yet. you know, I remember back in the days, you'd be like, oh, I got a pimple, I got a bump, whatever. Why they got these star stickers now? Oh, so, it's, a, it's 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 to cover them Jones, yeah. We all know that. So, are you ashamed that you got this acne, or you want now you want acne so you can wear a star sticker? Yeah, and that that you know what's funny? Which I'm one is so it? glad you brought up that point because that's a great point. It's like now people want to have that FOMO of like, yo, I kind of want acne so now I can put on the stars so and I can be cute and aesthetic yeah. and quirky. Like, bro, I'm like, yo, like we... <laughs> but then they be walking around with stars all over their face. I'm like, I'm you like, got stickers at... I'm like, okay. 21? So you insecure, <laughs> so you insecure about having acne, cool, but then we gonna do something that's gonna make you stand out and especially yeah. to bulls that never seen this type, John, or don't be on TikTok, you look dumb. You look dumb to them. And then, but you're also insecure about that because you want to, you didn't want to look dumb having acne. Yeah, so but I'm you like, put a... I don't understand. That's a part I want to say. But you put a star and that sticks out. And, and that's not even me hating on the star jones. I think it's cool. Yo, stars. I mean, shoot, I don't got my star earrings on or whatever. But yo, stars is one of my main jones, bro. I'm not going to lie. I like stars. I don't get the know, point man. of that. But but yeah, nah, but I could also agree. See, from someone that don't be seeing that jones all the time, you're like not nah, hip to that. You're like, yo, bro, what are you? Bro, you got like five stars on your face. What is you doing, young boy? Like, like what, what's wrong with you? You might as well just let the acne show. Word, like, I, nah, I'm going to keep it a buck fact. That's why, yo, if I get a pimple or something, I'm just like, hey, bro, we're going to put some clear seal or whatever, you know, John you use, and we're just going to let it yeah, go away. I'm just a little, I was just a little confused. It, it's, like, yo, see, that's what I'm saying. This, I knew this video was going to be good because, like, yo, this is the type of Jones I like commenting on. Like, bro, it's, it, bro, having insecurities, I could understand why because you would want to be better, but complaining mm -hmm. about them instead of trying to do something about it, if you can, right. again, if you can improve them or change that, John. It's like, bro, that's tough. Yeah, all in all, bro, stop going on TikTok. Head's going to make you feel insecure, especially with this looks maxing, John, bro. It's got to die. We got to get rid of it. We got to. I'm telling you. Go. In order to fix it healthily, you know, you do things such as Why are people out, doing the hammer thing? I hate time, that, that joke, unhealthy bro. Route, people take medications, even do oh. crazy things like breaking their bones to get taller. Yeah. Oh, no, I can't go to school with this. Oh, my God. Yo, I love this video. I'm sorry. Yo, Dorbel. Yo, shout out Dorbel. Please go watch more of his video because he really be getting into it. I'm not going to lie. That money video, bro. That money video is perfect, bro. If you are breaking your legs so you can get taller, bro. I will, oh, I don't care if you, bro, bro, I don't care if you was Uzi height 5'4", broke your legs, bro, became taller with 7'7". Seven, seven. I'm still looking down on you. No, I don't, <laughs> I don't understand. If you break still. your leg, when you go down? Oh, you break them so they can, like, move the bones up and add these, like, different stilts and John in your, in your leg. Oh, my bro, God. First of all, oh my just, God. just the sound of that sounds yeah. appalling. <laughs> Terrible. I don't want to go through this, bro. I'll just be short. <laughs> That's it. Oh, God. I thought the worst was back in the days when they said Janet Jackson um, removed the rib. What the heck? Why? Removed the rib to make her oh, slim here. Yeah. Like the corset type joints to make you remove the rib. Bro, that's a whole Now they want to break stuff, legs bro. and put stilts inside? Oh. Yo, y'all corset girl. Okay, cause we, we go, you know what? We're going to get on both sides. You know, we're going we gonna to start attacking both sides since we're doing it. Guys, yo, yo, you're insecure, bro. I'm going to forever look down on you if you get the leg lengthening, John, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna. I don't care. Again, like I said, I don't care if you Uzi height. You went from five four to seven seven. I'm still looking down on you. <laughs> I don't care if you literally look down on me, <laughs> bro. Ego wise, you're getting looked down on. Girls, y'all gotta remember that you got organs. I don't know <laughs> what is, bro. These corsets, bro. Some of y'all be looking wild on TikTok, bro. Wild, <laughs> insane. <laughs> like, bro. That's society doing. Yo, that. I'm anybody. like, I'm like, bro. How she swallow food? This ain't even normal. <laughs> Yo, y'all, we just gotta stop being insecure, bro. Like, we just gotta start locking in on ourselves for mm -hmm. real, for real. Like, I'm not even playing. This thing, bro, quit being so insecure. Huh? 
But there will come a day when you realize the impermanence of things, including yourself. And when you come to realize that nothing matters and no one cares about you as much as you do, it might help ease off some of the pressure of others since insecurity is in direct relation to the fear of judgment of others. And just so you know, I was talking with someone and I was wearing a bright red shirt and I went and changed to a blue one and they didn't even notice. So really. Hey, we're killer, mind the spot. That's funny. But yeah, bro. Y'all gotta stop caring. You got you gotta stop caring what randoms think about you, bro. I'ma keep it a buck. And maybe that's egotistical of me to, of me to say that. Mm. But bro, I'm literally not playing with y'all, bro. If if I don't consider the person family, their opinion of me literally means nothing. That's why I'm saying like some of y'all bulls, some some bulls will comment or whatever. And it's a perfect example of that. Some bulls will comment. Shoot, I might not even read it. But if I do read it, bro, at the end of the day, I don't care, gang. Bro. <laughs> I'm gonna see you one time on the comment. If you were a consistent hater, I'm gonna see you a couple times, bro. I've never seen you in real life. I don't care. <laughs> when I walk outside, when I walk away from my computer or phone, <laughs> only people talking to me is my dukes, my little sister, my bros. <laughs> like, bro, what? Bro, I don't care. Bro, like, I don't understand. You gotta <laughs> stop caring. Especially the, like, bro, especially if you, bro, if you taking criticisms from bulls on Twitter. <sighs> Alright, well, don't even get into it. I'm gonna just leave it alone. Lights not on you. You are just a background character of the majority of people in this world, and in the grand scheme of things, you will be forgotten quicker than you are remembered. Mm -hmm. I just got the ability to read minds today. Time to hop on this train and see what everyone thinks. Look at all these unconscious people. Look at all these unconscious people. Look at all these <laughs> unconscious people. Level four doesn't hold me back. This is your average person, right? But the thing is, I believe your average person is deeply insecure. Well, being shameless isn't the right route either, so it's dangerous. It's that balance we all have to walk in life, but the danger really comes from the fact that we are all so misconstructed on what it really means to be whole and fulfilled. Oftentimes we find ourselves choosing escapism instead of facing the shadows that lurk in mm -hmm. us. A chain reaction of fuel pain, feed dopamine. And after- I like, yo, hold on, this diagram I'm really hitting right now. Pain route solutions. Feeling pain, mental or physical. Worst route, better route, the cure. Worst route, dopamine escapism. Mm -hmm. I could agree. And, mm -hmm. and yo, and I like to keep it a super to buck with y'all. I'm going to keep it a buck. Sometimes I'll be choosing a worst route. I can't even mm -hmm. lie. Is it the best route? Obviously, is it the best decision? No. But sometimes it just be like that. We're all human. But we want to choose these routes. Better route. Dopamine, uh, dopamine escapism, working out, meditation. So basically, it's the same thing, except you know, obviously, things these these things won't really improve your mm -hmm. life. Um, these things will. And the cure: investigate, journal, find the root, uh, process it, look for lessons, accept, forgive, and find. This is absolutely true. I'm blocking it, y'all. My fault. Okay. But like, this is absolutely what you should do. I ain't gonna lie. I always say, bro. And again, I guess y'all could look at me as cold or heartless. When it comes to situations, let's say you're getting an argument, right? When it comes to situations, you need to find the root cause. Yo, what caused this problem? Oh, my bad. You need to find the root cause. You need to see, yo, what, what's the main problem? Why does argument, why did this problem start or whatever? Boom, we're going to eliminate that. Why are we going through 17 hoops? We talking about all these other Jones people feel a certain way. I'm like, all right, if you want to feel a certain way, cool. But can we just at least extinguish the main problem, bro? Because mm -hmm. you just added more Jones on to it that, that we didn't need to deal with. You feel me? Like, mm -hmm. and, and, and my fault that I'm, I guess I'm disregarding emotions in that case, bro. But like, real life, bro, the problem is already over. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's tough. But like, yeah. This is the best way to do it. I, I can't I can't lie. This this would be the best way, bro. Come on. Years of the cycle, one day you wake up to realize that shadow's been put in the work and you are left defeated and overwhelmed. The sooner you come to terms <laughs> with the fact that there's a bad side of you is when you can finally figure out how to address it. Mm -hmm. Huh. I feel like trash. I guess I'll just watch some TV to keep my mind off of it. It's still there. Alright, bud. I'm in control. Yeah. <laughs> This is quite literally my worst fear. I have two things. I have a I have a worst pet peeve that'll make me hate you instantly. And this is my worst fear of, of being stagnant. I tell mom all the time. I'm, I'll be like, yo, mom, I'm low-key having a midlife crisis. I'm feeling stagnant. We not improving. We not, we not, we not getting to our dreams. This is literally mm -hmm. my worst fear ever, bro. Nah, uh bro. Ten years later, we still sitting here. Mm -mm. Bro, I be feeling bad. I be, I be really feeling like this just because, yo. A week ago, I felt like I was still sitting here watching YouTube. What? <laughs> this a yo, this this a problem. Like yo, I'm telling y'all, bro, it's crazy. Wow. Go take a jump off that ledge. Yeah, let's no, not do please that. Don't no. make me. No. The ability to look in the mirror and say this is okay is what it's all about. But I say most can't do that. Wait, hold including on, is that, me. Mm -hmm. I mean, Wait, was I, that Luffy? Hold on. Say this what? is okay is what it's all about.
I'm looking around. It is. It's Luffy. I knew I wasn't tweaking. Like, oh my god! I'm like, I'm I like, didn't even these, see that. These are all anime characters and like like characters okay, from cartoons. Okay, because that's Pikachu. And Here's everything. a Fallout okay. guy. Pikachu, Deadpool. Um, oh, Patrick. Where do you see Patrick? Down at the bottom. Pat. Yeah, Patrick. The one bull from the uh uh from freaking what's the Hey Arnold or yeah no it is Hey Arnold. Um, <laughs> that's a good Spider Man. <laughs> like, that's a good. Uh, um yeah. This young okay word I'm writing drawing yeah. oh teenage mutant ninja turtles I think I'm actually not no wait is this no 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 I don't think so about but I say most can't do that including me I mean I'd say over the half of the population covers their physical insecurities through makeup hats wigs surgeries and so mm -hmm. on but what is the beauty industry without insecurity it's out of business now into level five confidence mm. you ever walked into a gym locker room and there's an old person who doesn't care one bit in the world that they're naked in front of everyone yeah. now that's <laughs> confidence it makes us a... <laughs> hold on I got y'all yeah I know what it is come on hold on <laughs> nah, this be having me crying though. I'm not gonna get that joke. Back to the video. <laughs> Yo, bye bye. Yeah, nah, bro. This 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 the looks max and type Joan. This this what they be talking about when they be saying confidence. I'm like, mm -hmm. nah, bro. Confidence really just mean, bro, hey, like I'm comfortable in my own skin, bro. I know I'm not the best looking bull, but that's fine. Some of y'all be like, oh nah, you gotta be a Chad. Mm. Mewing and John, like, yo, stop playing me, bro. Get on my face. <laughs> Self acceptance and lack of fear. Oh, Crazy nah. are out there, right? Bro, don't talk to me with your junk out. Huh? Suit yourself. In this modern age, <laughs> I believe being a narcissist and egotistic is viewed as confidence, which exactly. is honestly hilarious since, quite frankly, it's the opposite. It's since dumb. those issues root from deep senses of insecurity. insecurity. That's yeah, massive. Exactly. I'm better than everyone else facade. Trying to be better than others isn't confidence by any means. I'm so much better than everyone else with my looks and possessions. But let's just say you were to lose it all, would you still be so exactly. self-assured? No. Well, of no. course. Alright, let's test that theory. <laughs> so truthfully, <laughs> confidence is really simple. It's pretty much just trusting yourself, but the real struggle will arise when you can't trust your emotional regulation and perception of reality. And we have this lens with which we use to view the world, and ideally mm -hmm. that lens would be perfectly clean, but unfortunately it's made up of all our life experiences and things we've witnessed. Everyone's so negative and mean on here. What the, what the, somebody, what the, what they, what they do to you, bro? Make fun of the way my hair looks. I'm sorry about that, bro. Uh, you a good guy, though, seem like, bro. Don't let that shit get to you, buddy. Facts. You good? No, I just told you why. What's, what's wrong with your hair? What's wrong with your hair? Let me see your hair, bro. I'll just see if it's cool. Oh, nah. Yeah, but who are you to judge? It can't be that. Damn! Oh, my! Yeah, I had a feeling this was about to happen. I ain't gonna lie. I had a, okay, well, had a hefty this feeling hell? this was about to happen. <laughs> yeah, man, I seriously, though, like, it's, There's a lot of ways of fixing that. Who cares? Like... <laughs> Even, if, even, even and I agree. No, there is a lot, so, of, a ton of ways of fixing. Yeah. But even so, even if you don't, who, bro? Who cares? Like, bro, realistically, like, no one, bro. We, bro, we got so many other things in life to be worrying about, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, bro, if I'm super broke, which I am, you really think I'm gonna care about how another bull look? Let alone how I look? I got no cheese. And I got, and I know that that's gonna that that could be materialistic, but again, yo, right. my y'all know my favorite quote: cool. "Get your money in up, not your fun y'all up." So I'm just trying. Yo, we gotta put Dukes in the mansion. That so that that I could agree with y'all with. That's on a materialistic vibe. But still though, even if so, let, let's take it to a whole wholesale vibe. If I'm chilling, I know my fam good. We we going out, then we having a good time. Life is chilling. Mm -hmm. You really think I care about how another bull look, bro? I'm trying to make my family smile every day, bro. I don't care, like son. Like, hey, hey, bro, this is and this is that social media, that TikTok, Twitter, John, bro. Like, come on, bro. I could put my phone down. I'm like, what are we talking about? My God! And when this lens gets distorted from negative responses throughout life, it can turn that natural confidence into self-esteem issues. We aren't born insecure. All right, sir, would you like to meet your son? Well, of course. All right, here you go. Google, Google, why are my arms still pudgy? They really are. And here we are with level six, me, myself, and I. You take complete responsibility for who you are and what happens to you. And I mean every way, mm -hmm. physically, emotionally, and mentally. When you are here, the only thing of importance is your internal validation. Nothing of the external will sway you into the negative. This is striving for perfection while accepting the current moment. 
That is quite. I think. I think this would be the level that I'm at. Not on some like, oh my god, bro. He's so. He's bro. This fool really think he the main character. It's just like, yo, I'm not the perfect bull. I'm not the worst bull ever. Mm -hmm. But I'm not the perfect bull. But I'm cool where I'm at. But I'm striving to be the best version of myself. That's. Mm -hmm. I think this is legitimately the best way. Like everybody should think and go about life. And not again, personal bias. Like we could all disagree. It is subjective. Right. Obviously, but yeah, like bro, just acknowledge, yo, yeah, you cool who you is, you you are who you are. That's not gonna change, cause that's that's all. I guess you could also say is with beliefs, cause I'm a believer in, bro. You only got one life. I don't know if reincarnation, all that is real. If it is, hey, that's fire, bro. I guess we get another chance. But like, yo, <laughs> like you know what I'm saying? Like my my fault if that's offensive. But like, it, yo, I, I would hope we get another chance. I'd be mm -hmm. pretty lit. But like, yeah, like we only get one life. So I'm like, yo, bro, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be who I am. That's tough. Like I I can't change that. So. We gonna try to better ourselves too, though. I ain't gonna lie. Listen, eat well, eat well, go run, hit the gym a little bit, mm -hmm. journal. I feel like journaling is really underrated. Like, if if not journaling, bro, write down things you be seeing throughout your days. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it do be helping. I got a quote book. That joint fire. I gotta show mom that joint. I ain't gonna lie. True quotes, fire. <laughs> Best in the biz. They know. Come on. Oh no, the parachute's not deploying. I shouldn't have gone to the skydiving place with a two-star mm -hmm. rating. So that means you what should a have a positive rating. feedback loop, <laughs> which only happens by reprogramming. Okay, let me see. Perceive everything as positive. Okay. okay. Tell. Oh, let me not block this. Oh, Tell yourself things just go my way. Facts. Okay. Things go your way. Yo, like what? What's the other joint I used to say all the time, mom? And and I still believe, obviously, because you should. If you spread negativity, what do you expect to happen to you? Or what do you expect? What what interaction Negative. do you expect? Negative. So if you spread positivity, what do you think gonna happen? Positive. Exactly. You're gonna see positive mm -hmm. action. So if you perceive everything as positive, as said, mm -hmm. you'll tell yourself things is things is gonna mm -hmm. go their way, you know, things gotta go my way. I'm trying to think in the best light. Guess what's gonna happen? Ah things go your way. But you keep telling yourself you broke, you're gonna stay broke. Oh no, that's cause I am broke, but we're not gonna be broke forever. <laughs> we get our money on the up. Mm. Y'all gonna see 10k in the account. I'm gonna be feeling great. And then we gonna keep stacking. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie. No cap. Shout out y'all. Shout out y'all for watching these videos though. Without y'all though, we, we, I'm not getting no cheese. Mm -hmm. So yo, if you, if you made it to this point, shout out you. You better be subscribed too. Dead mm -hmm. not playing with you, bro. <laughs> mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie. Subscribe for Dukes. Mom says subscribe. You got yes. To. Make your mind. You have to see the positive in everything. I'll give an you example. Said, no, As a though. child, yeah. I was beaten at home try. and school. You know, when I tell that to people, they say I'm sorry, but like, why are you sorry? It, it's a great thing. And I know you guys are probably confused, but hear me out. After integrating and processing that, it gave me a secret strength. And that strength comes when things get hard now as an adult. I'll remember how bad life was at one point, and that mm -hmm. makes it really hard to be upset with my current circumstance. Mm -hmm. I've had exactly. moments where I worked for 20 hours straight because it's not that bad. When you realize that the worst is our Already over life gets easy because that means the best is ahead yeah i was thinking about starting a business you know you'll probably struggle for years right a struggle means nothing when life has been much worse than being poor yo <laughs> oh my god bro yo yeah oh my fault i didn't mean it i meant, I meant to enlarge the camera yo shout out doorbell for real for real bro because he's re again that's why i really like watching bro's video because he really be spitting facts i don't know if y'all really listening to this june because bro exactly what he just said where yeah bro you're gonna struggle but you know as soon as that struggle is over you're gonna be straight mm -hmm. i think that is quite literally the definition of what we doing with this channel and with life bro like oh my god of course, it's going to be hard to grow. Bro, oh my god. Yo, mom, I'm really thinking about this hefty. This really is that. It, it, it took a minute to get to get on the YouTube Partner Program. Got to get the 4K hours, 1,000 subscribers. Got to it. Cool. Mm -hmm. Now we in the process. Yo, we growing. We growing. But I hit 2K subscribers, bro. On the Partner Program. Second check about to come soon. I'm feeling good. Guess what? The other checks come. Now we start making some more better content. Mm -hmm. Start growing. Get your views up. Oh, <laughs> next thing you know, 5 bad, 5 bath. Now I'm talking hefty mm -hmm. <laughs> i ain't gonna lie yo life gonna be life gonna be what life gonna be straight straight speaking into existence exactly Let's go <laughs> bill's gonna be paid mm -hmm. paid Yo, shout out Dorbo, bro. This video is fantastic. And the second thing that pain has taught me is empathy. I can feel for people a lot easier since for every person I see in pain, I can look at them mm -hmm. and say, I understand. Pain yeah. is a teacher if you integrate the lessons instead of wallowing in the experience. Ooh, and if you get to the point where your mind encapsulates the essence Ooh, that of line positivity, was then chances are you'll get everything line. you've ever Yeah, wanted. no, that's cool. I'm going to be honest. I got to hear that one more time because that's going straight into the quote book. I'm not even playing. Like, I'm telling y'all, I was dead serious about that journal, y'all. Like, I got a quote book. That's going straight down. Hold on. Pain is a teacher if 
you integrate the lessons instead of wallowing in the experience. And Mmm, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> mm, that one hit. And if you get to the point where your mind encapsulates the essence of positivity, then chances are you'll get everything you've ever wanted in life, especially yep. once you understand the way to get it is by working towards it. Mm. Yep. Now to the last one, level seven. Actualized. When you are alone and Must no end. one is there to judge you, that's what I see as your truest form of self, unformed by the judgment of this world. But as life goes on, trauma happens, coping mechanisms take place. For example, when you grow up in a dangerous household, expecting the worst is actually a method of keeping yourself safe. But when you become an adult, suddenly it's a very negative trait to hold. And I personally believe all these lessons are made just for you. You don't need to believe it, but look for mm. the lesson in everything you might start to find rapid growth. You know, sometimes I think about the most traumatizing parts of my past. Why would you do that? Well, for a while, I saw it as a puzzle to be solved, but instead I realized it never really happened outside of my own mind, and so it doesn't really exist anymore unless I allow it to. I perceived it for a month. <laughs> I, was, I was like, yo, let me get real sorry. No, I'm like, hold on. It really doesn't exist unless I allow it to. We really mm -hmm. talking right now. Mm -hmm. Yo, we're. Yo, bruh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Listen. I know I be making fun of Gen Alpha, Young Bulls, all the Jones, bro. He's really talking. I don't know if y'all are listening, bro. Yo, if the if you're making up the problems in your own head, bro, they gonna persist, bro. They gonna per you gonna perceive everything as a problem, bro. They gonna persist, bro. They gonna stay. But yo, guess what? I'm not looking at it as a problem, baby. <laughs> that boy don't exist. Mm hmm. <laughs> Bro, I need to hear that one more time. Mm -hmm. Yo, mm -hmm. we're really talking right now, bro. Like, we're really chatting. Like, hold You on. know, sometimes I think about the most traumatizing parts of my past. Why would you do that? Well, for a while, I saw it as a puzzle to be solved, but mm. instead I realized it never really happened outside of my own mind, mm. and so it doesn't really exist anymore unless I allow it to. Mm. I perceived it from my eyes, and I judged how it was processed in my mind. You know, the residuals of those experiences are internal, and they might as well be made up since the memories are so fuzzy on the details. So that means its existence feeds on my attention. Mm. I this is going straight into the quote book. Oh my god, bruh. This John not going to exist if I don't give it attention. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I couldn't have said it better. Mm -hmm. Let it go. <laughs> what? Yo. Mm -hmm. Yo, hot. Bro, nah, bro. Hold on. <laughs> I got I to gotta look, bro. You got to look for what? Bro, Dorble. Only 60k? Get his subscribers up now. <laughs> now. Now. I need to see him at 100k by the end of this month. Like, bro. He's really talking, bro. Like, like this ain't no me. Like, I know he got the drone over there. Be the funny stick Jones. This, mm -hmm. bro. None of the subjects we talk about here is memes. Bro, this some real Jones. Mm -hmm. He said. Mm -hmm. So, and he said, bro, if you don't perceive that Jones as a problem, if you don't acknowledge it, bro, it is not one. Mm -hmm. That is tough. Mm-hmm. If I don't give you no attention to that, John. You letting it live. You keep the light to that fire. On God, bro. If you don't give attention to it, bro, it does not exist. I can't perceive it. Oh, my God. Yo, we really talking, bro. This, bro, y'all not, I'm not, I'm dead not even playing this, John. Going, like, bro, the John he said earlier and this, going straight into the quote book, bro. This is insane levels of wisdom right now. I have dominion over my mind, so I get to choose if I want to let it go. If you say otherwise, who's in control? But at the end of the day, what's the most accurate version of you? The one others hold of you or your personal perception? Mm -hmm. I think most of us agree our personal perception. So stop yes. focusing on what others think and focus on what you think of the yep. aspects of yourself. And take sometimes what you stop don't thinking like so many things. God! Ken, I'm a firm believer that the competition isn't crazy out there, especially here in America. It's very easy to be above average. If you run towards excellence instead of running away from the pain of the journey, Hey, yo, bro, why are you running if so you fast? run towards excellence instead of the pain of the jet bro yo y'all not listening bro y'all not keep listening. going just keep going y'all not don't listening don't worry about man. it yeah you felt it not listening bro. you felt there somebody hit you there they talked about bro. you there they said, ah, ah, blah, okay bro. fine no problem just keep no. going Keep Yo, going. everything Dorbel is saying right now is, is is quite literally the exact reason why I live life the way I do, Keep bro. Keep going. Like, quite Keep literally, going. bro. I'm I'm not, this I'm one. not yeah, looking at the problems. Yeah, talk about you this one. Yeah, talk about you this one. Throw this after this one. Say, I'm this not about, about to keep looking keep at going. the negativity, bro.
And even sometimes you got to tell yourself, ah, shut up, Girl, and keep going. I want to ah, see my up, people accomplish <laughs> their dreams. You think I'm about to worry about not doing that? <laughs> I think I'm worried about everything else. You think I'm worried about impressing this, trying to do that, being insecure, this? Bro, I got to put my people's dreams into reality. Y'all boys is crazy. These boys is insane. Uh, Oh my god, yeah, and I, the adorable's absolutely going right. Wow. I right gotta now. stay away from my problems. <laughs> <laughs> Homie, I, I don't think you're gonna get away from them like that. And remember, love is the answer, and insecurities are just an aspect of self that you disown and dislike. If mm -hmm. you were in front of a crowd and you were asked to say you love a fruit, you'd have no struggle. But if you were asked to say you love yourself, then there would be one. I mean, go ahead and try it alone. You might notice a hesitation. How are you supposed to love the world if you can't even love the thing that perceives it? Mm. And feel free to leave a this like. Is why, always, okay, you, to or, add on to what he just said, this is exactly why I said, yo, bro, if you don't love yourself, you how could you how could you love someone mm -hmm. else? How? Mm -hmm. How? Tell me right now. If you do not love yourself, if you don't know love personally, how are you going to give that emotion to someone else? How? Mm -hmm. How you don't know love, gang? Mm -hmm. Bro, this, bro, yeah. yo, me. um, this one slapped me in the jaw, bro. <laughs> me too. This one slapped me in me. the jaw. I, I, yo, I, I came, I looked at this I'm bin. I'm thinking about all things over differently right now. Facts, <laughs> like, yo, oh my God. <laughs> like, bro, I put on everything. I'm like, okay, you know what, <laughs> This is exactly why, bro. Yo. yo, you just got you just you just got do John. I saw Dorbo just posted this video. I'm like, bro, I really want to watch this John. Seven levels of insecurity. I'm like, yeah, I know he gonna talk about the red pill bull, all these dumb Jones. Bro, I don't care nothing about a red pill bull right now. Bro, he talked mm. he talked to me on a level of mind that I wasn't even ready for today, mm -hmm. bro. <laughs> he talked to me, bro. <laughs> <he's>, <laughs> I'm still on the line, bro. He said, bro. The reason my problems don't all I still persist is because I perceive them as that, John, bro. If, if I don't give them attention, bro, mm. they don't exist. <laughs> I'm like, oh, my God. you ain't even thinking about it. You ain't worried about it. He might like, other things. Oh, Lord. Thank you. He was talking to me. Thank you, Lord. I was me. like, whoa. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Dorbo. <laughs> I was mm. like, huh? Thank you. I'm like, I'm like, oh. Like what? Thank you. Thank you for that message. <laughs> I'm going to let Dorbo finish it out. Okay. No Thank you for that message. Right here. Oh, that's it. Yo, mm -hmm. bro. Yeah, that was Dorbo. Seven levels insecurity. I'm dead. I'm dead serious, bro. I'm going to give y'all five seconds right now. Go subscribe to bro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right now. Mm -hmm. I, bro. Yeah, nah, he, he gotta be he gotta be top three right now. Mm -hmm. Cause like, bro, every bit I watch, every time he watched Doro, I be I be really feeling what he's in. Every time the money vid I felt it, this vid, I'm feeling it. I'm dumb excited for the next vid. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I'm gonna be feeling that one too. Yeah, if you didn't want to hear the big yap sesh over that boy, of course, the video definitely gonna be down in the description below. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it need to be. It better be. Like, bro, I already know it is. <laughs> I got to come back to this because there are so many quotes I got to write mm -hmm. down in my book, which is insane, mm -hmm. <laughs> that you can drop this mm -hmm. much game in a vid, bro, mm -hmm. to where I got to write down four plus quotes. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, that's really tough. But yeah, y'all. Adorable seven loves insecurity. Like I said, down description below. Please go watch the original joint if you want to hear the yap. Shoot, just go watch it because, yo, yo. <laughs> He dropped a bomb. You, you need to rewatch. You need to hear this over and over. <laughs> this definitely going into the yo when I'm feeling down playlist, mm -hmm. bro. Cause this boy, this boy picking me right up, boy. I'm coming at this boy like these. I'm telling you, whatever what? I was, the stuff I was complaining about before we did this video is gone. It's gone. I was gonna because say, I'm you know what? Only I'm gonna let it be here. Exactly. I'm Only like, you bro. can control you. Only you can <laughs> allow what to happen to happen to you. Sheesh. It's not about how you react. It's your Sheesh. reaction. <laughs> it's your reaction. I'm like, oh. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Dang, mm -hmm. I ain't perceiving nothing as problems no more, bro. Y'all mm -hmm. could go ahead and perceive them as that. I'm cool. I, I, no, yo, what? what's the joint in the gym, bro, in the Bible? And I'm not even really a believer like that, but, yo, no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Mm, Isaiah 54, 17. <laughs> <laughs> Sheesh. All that stuff. Mm -hmm. But yeah, y'all, of course, mom, we at the end. Yes, yo, we gotta come get on. Out you, gotta, you gotta tell them what they got. <laughs> All right, they just bitch. gotta remember to go subscribe to Dorbo. They gotta remember. Yeah, no, that, please. Okay? I'm not playing, mm -hmm. bro. Please All right, go, go subscribe, subscribe to, to him. Go watch some of his videos. For sure. Okay. Speak. Hit the thumbs up on this video. Mm -hmm. All right. Two up. Make sure you comment. What what which one of them levels? <laughs> I mean, you don't have to share, that's your personal insight. 
But you know, what what hit you? <laughs> I would say okay. personally, I'm on level six because I don't want to straight mm. be that boy like, oh, I'm on level seven. Mm -mm. But level seven, level seven's knowledge really slapping me. I'm mm -hmm. not gonna lie. I'm, I'm about in to six, keep seven. Rereading these quotes, like, oh mm -hmm. yeah, now nah, we we gotta get to level seven for sure. Mm -hmm. Like, <laughs> like mm -hmm. yo, no cap. But yeah, comment down below right. which level you feel like and you then want. And subscribe. I can't even English. Lord, you know, messed me up, boy. <laughs> you know, messed yeah. me up, all right? Yo, that, okay. yo, this video is fantastic, <laughs> subscribe. bro. This video subscribe. Subscribe, so and then don't like. forget to... Ah! <laughs> Turn it up, post notification <laughs> button. Every time it says family post a new video, our boy be fresh, hot, spicy, fiery, and... Always in your feed. I ain't gonna lie, it's the boy Trill, bro. Just, <laughs> just subscribe to Adorable, bro. Yeah. That's all I'm really worried about right now. Cause he really putting in, putting in work, bro. Mm -hmm. It's lit, and we are gonna catch y'all later. Peace. Mm -hmm.